Hello viewers, we'll be going over JNUG and JDUS. In this video, we'll be going over my trade idea of the week and the day-by-day -day probability model. So let's start off with the 10 logo analysis. On Friday, JNUG closed down 1.5% on the one hour chart. We are we were starting to approach to positive MACD, however, we saw signs of it diverging midway in Friday. And as for the four hour chart, we are bouncing right along the 200 moving average of this green line so that does act as our temporary support if we do reverse lower and that support level is around $154.10 as for the 4 MACD we are starting to approach to negative territory if we expand that to the daily chart we are also resting right along the 50 day moving average this yellow line and that would also act as our support to the upside and for the daily MACD, we saw a convergence still in positive territory. And for the trade idea of the week for JNUG, my position size is going to be less than 1%. So my entry will be $147.74, which is this range right here. That will be my long entry. And that coincides with past support levels. And for my sell target, that will be $161.98 which also coincides with past resistance that dated back to September 1st as well as on Friday, September 18th. And my stop loss will be $142.71. As for JDUS, on Friday it closed above 1.4% and if we zoom into the one hour chart, we have it now approached to positive MACD territory and that is the 30 minute chart. As for the one hour chart, we have now approached the positive MACD territory and if we expand that a bit further onto the four hour chart, we are starting to make a reversal. We saw a divergence back in September 16th, so there is slight upward momentum. If we expand that to the daily chart, what we have here is we continue to make slightly lower lows at the moment and we did make a slight reversal back in September 16th and I do expect us to see JDUS trade more sideways in the next coming days. As for JDUS, my long entry will be $9.18 which is this range right there where we made the lows this week back in September 15th as well as September 16th. That will be my long entry and my sell target will be $9.95 which is fairly close to where we have the 9 day moving average that will be my sell target and my stop loss will be $8.97 so how did I develop these trade ideas? It all comes from the day by day probability model which is available in the link below so for the model we're examining GDXJ which is for J JNUG is a leverage and for JDUS is inverse leverage so do keep that in mind and also we're only examining three models found, so it's just quite a small sample size, so do keep this in mind. As we progress to the fifth day or week of tra trading, we have a 67% chance for it to fall between 0 to negative 5%. And to dance up, we have an extreme case of 33% chance to fall between negative 10% to negative 16%. Again, this is a small sample size, so do keep that in mind. So if you enjoy this content, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching.